Hey there, future achievers! Welcome to the crew. I'm Sandesh, your go-to guide for all things productivity, mindfulness, and personal finance. If you're ready to take charge of your life, then hit that subscribe button and ring the bell icon because today we're talking about a company that went from making graphic cards from gamers to becoming a three trillion giant, none other than Nvidia. The same company that once just helped run GTA V on ultra settings is now more valuable than Google, Amazon and Tesla. But how did this happen? What made Nvidia the disrupted king of AI? And most importantly, can you profit from this $3 trillion revolution? Stick around because this story is wild. Imagine this, it's the 90s, you walk into a computer store looking for a way to play better games. But buy a graphics card from this tiny company called Nvidia. Thinking cool, better graphics, fast forward 30 years and that same company is now fueling the AI revolution, powering self-driving cars, crypto mining, and even NASA-level space research. So how did this company that made gaming GPUs became the backbone of artificial intelligence? It all started with a big, bold bet. Picture this. 1993, three engineers, Jensen Huang, Chris Malkowski, and Curtis Priam start NVIDIA with one simple goal, make computer graphics better. At the time, the gaming industry was exploding, but computers sucked at rendering realistic graphics. Enter NVIDIA's first breakthrough, the Gen 4 256. This baby was the first GPU ever and changed gaming forever. But here's where things get interesting. While NVIDIA became household name for gamers, Jensen Huang had bigger plan. He saw something no one else did. The GPU wasn't just for games, it was for a computer powerhouse. So imagine you have a sports car that's super fast but only used for delivering pizza. That's how NVIDIA saw GPUs. In the early 2000s, they were crazy powerful but only used for gaming. So in 2006, NVIDIA made a huge gamble. They developed CUDA, a software that allowed GPUs to handle complex competitions beyond graphics. And guess what? No one cared. Investors were like, dude, just stick to gaming. But Xiong, he doubled down and then boom, AI happened. Researchers discovered that NVIDIA's GPUs were perfect for training artificial intelligence models. Suddenly, every AI startup, research lab, and big tech company needed NVIDIA chips. It was game over for the competition. Now here's where things get insane. In 2010s, AI exploded. Companies like OpenAI, Google, and Tesla needed thousands of GPUs to train their machine learning models. And who had the best GPUs? Yes. NVIDIA. Fast forward to today and NVIDIA's chips power almost every major AI project on the planet. From chat GPT to self-driving cars, from drug discovery to robotics, if AI is the future, NVIDIA is the gold rush supplier. And let's talk money. In 2016, NVIDIA stock was around $30. Today, it's over $1,000. If you had invested just $1,000 back then, you'd have over $33,000 today. Not bad for a company that started with a gaming, right? All right, so what now? NVIDIA's dominance isn't slowing down. They're launching new AI-focused chips. They're partnering with companies like Tesla and Meta and expanding into data centers, autonomous vehicles, and even the metaverse. But is this too late to invest? Some experts say NVIDIA stock is overvalued. Others believe we are just getting started. One thing's for sure, AIs isn't slowing down and NVIDIA is at the heart of it. So here's the question for you. Do you think NVIDIA can reach a 5 trillion valuation? Or will competition finally catch up? Drop your thoughts in the comment. If you found this video insightful, don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that bell icon so you don't miss out on more deep dives into the world of tech, finance, and productivity. This is all for today. Stay curious, stay ambitious, and catch you in the next one.